Okay, so I wanted to make a game, but I did make a game. It's called Grandma's House, and this is my devlog to it. It's most it's just the small little portions I recorded of like updates of making it. I don't think I'm going to edit this. This might be a long video though. So, yeah. Here we are. Let's go. <laughs> okay. So, I added the frog going to be funny. But I'm working on a new game since my last game I stopped caring about. And yeah, you can't leave basically. Unless you go in the chat. Which also still doesn't work. So I think I'm gonna. Go to I put it here. The field of view is normally seventy. Okay, that should fix it. So Oh, that makes stuff scarier. So, yeah. This is the game lobby. And, <laughs> I think I might hide the frog somewhere on the map. And if any people can find him, they should document it. The, we don't, I don't really need a multiplayer test. But this is clipping through the wall. And I need to remove the open ability from this. So. Yeah, I'm going to do that. It's here. These are the things in the drawer, which I can just delete. Drawer script. Wood holding nature. Is it anchored? Now it is. Okay, let's test it and see if that fixed it. Okay, so I'm going to have to remove that somehow. Oh, wait. That should fix it. Okay. This was not supposed to be a three minute long documentation. Yeah, that fixed the drawer. And I'm going to end this documentation of the progress I made in the game. So yeah. Another devlog. It's, I did add a bit of furniture to each area. And I hit the frog in places. So yeah. I'm still working on it, but... Right now, I'm think I think it's pretty good, and yeah, I'm gonna try to fix the bases for this. So yeah, this is devlog two. I want to make multiple devlogs, so you know the process of making this game, because this is actually hard. If I do make these into a video, I will smash them all together. But yeah, devlog two. Goodbye. Another demo time. So. I'm going to add more frogs. And a crawling feature. But I added furniture. 
furniture in there, in there, in there, and yeah, I got a bookshelf, and you can't open any of these, I don't think. Hopefully. This. Oh, I broke this one, but, eh. It doesn't have to have collision. I mean, not collision. I can just restart. <gasps> Shoot! Okay, that's the end of this devlog. Devlog report, I have no idea. Just kidding, it's three. Publishing the game to Roblox. So, it's easier. Save to Roblox, not publish. Save to Roblox as... Grand Muzz house horror Horror. No, because I'm probably gonna have blood. Save. Devlog. Yeah. Okay, this is save to Roblox. And let's press play. So, I fixed this. Now you can't do that. Uh, what? Oh, I'm stuck in there now. This is a drawer. So, yep, that's devlog. Oh, frogs. Yeah, the frogs. You gotta find the frogs. But just in case I ever forget in the future and come back to this devlog, you can delete the drawer stuff by going to here. And you gotta anchor that. And you delete that, that, and that, and then the clicker you also delete. So yeah. Also have folders. Oh wait, I'm not recording it. So well, I guess feature me is doomed. If I forget, you you have separate rooms of one, two, and three players. So they all have limits. I don't know why it says my place, even though it has a name. Also, some frogs are easier to find than others. So, that one has no drawers, so check that one. I check that one. This one doesn't have a working drawer. This, I'm gonna check this one. This one's drawers are all messed up. This one doesn't, drawers are fine. So I'm gonna reset character and then go to the other one and check those, the other one's doors. Drawers. And yep, it's fine. So, yep, that's devlog, goodbye. So I'm gonna work on the next part of this game, which is the actual game part. I took a break for a few days, but yeah.
this is what I have. I kind of gotta look around because I haven't been here for a bit. Spawning locations over here, right in the middle. So when I press play, it should spawn me around the middle. Yeah, like that. I think this is nice, but this thing is you can't really do the chat, the leave. So yeah, that's this so far. I uh, will catch you up in a bit when it's I do like the map part of the next thing. See you there. So I made this. It's a box, and as you can see. I'm keeping the frogs. They're gonna be everywhere around this house. Let's test it out. Let's test this game out. Oh, what? The cursor's missing. But you don't press E to open the doors. You actually walk into them. But yeah, this is what I have. I need to fix that. So this is what I have so far. I'll catch you up in the next update. Ah, oh, the thing at the bottom. But yeah, this is it. Bye. See you in the next update. So I forgot to do another update, but this is what I have so far. It's basically the entire inside of the house. They got the kitchen. The starting area. Here, I'll show you it in the game. So. Basically... You got the kitchen over here, which you can open and close stuff. You can't close that door. You got these. Yeah, that. You got the kitchen. Playing for this to be like an outside area, or like an area that leads to outside. That's what I was gonna do. And then over here, oh, I gotta move this back. But you got this, the, the bed, dresser, bookshelf, dish area. So yeah, that's what I have so far. Sorry for not doing a thing. I forgot to. And yeah, that's it for now. Okay, so I did finish the ceiling. So you can walk up here, and you have the bedroom. I added a couch here, because I didn't know what to add. But, yeah. I think you, no, you can't, but there's a spot back there. I'm going to fix that. And it's off-centered. Yes, I did make a huge blob, so it's, there's no light. That's better. So, yeah, this is it so far. I have, oh yeah, I've made this area, but I haven't made the outside area yet. So, I'll tell you when I do that, basically. Yeah, bye. Okay, so I made a bit outside of stuff. So yeah, let's go over there. Oh, I gotta fix that. This got launched open, I'm assuming. Oh, scale, I forgot about that. I'm gonna add a little window here. Even though there's nothing there, it's design. So yeah, that's it.
There we go. And boom, fix that. <coughs> so yeah, this is my progress update again. Yeah. I'm getting a window. Also, this is a design choice for <laughs> Stuff to look cartoony from one part and scary from the another. So here's what I'm going to do. Part. Anchored. Set the color to black, drag it over to here, and put it right behind the glass. Fill the area here. Oh, that one is open. But yeah my progress update and I think I'm doing pretty good this area still needs a lot of furniture <laughs> and from the back just don't look at look at it from the back I just did this because you don't see the back ever minecraft tree <laughs> it has all the a bunch of textures of it and you scale it down and it has one two three. <laughs> yeah progress update bye see you next time in the progress update so I did a thing. Uh, basically, I did the outside a bit. Now I haven't done any scaling things, so I don't know how this would look. I gotta fix that, but there's a chest. Oh, you can see the end of that. I gotta bring this barrier back a bit. But yeah, the outside is nice and done. The house looks a bit weird here, but that's the point. And yeah, thanks for seeing this part. I don't know why I'm saying thank you, but I guess I'm saying thank you to myself for remembering to do this by myself and other people. Okay, so I'm adding lights, and I did get this area furnished. So yeah, just the lights, and then I have to add an ending to this game and I did add mountains all around besides the exit area and I put the chest in the ground so yeah Is Minecraft grass terrain? I don't know, but I'm not gonna use it. Okay, so that's the end of this devlog. I'm gonna put frogs in places too. Oh yeah, and I added this. The rocking chair. <coughs> so let's test it out. Oh yeah, I added candles in here. I'm stuck. Okay, that's an evil chair. <sighs> I'm gonna move this into the corner.
Okay, I gotta remove that script. I know it's gonna make it so you can jump, but it makes it so if you sit down. Okay, now you can. But being able to jump makes it so you might be able to escape. Unless these walls are escapeless. Oh, no, there we go. I just need to add a roof to this area. Oh yeah, the flashlight makes sound, but you can't hear it because I muted the sound. So yeah. The one back here just makes it. See, so you spawn there. So yeah, I'm gonna s end this thing and then I'll start it back later when I fix some stuff. Okay, so I did get the game finished, and I think I'll get this video out by, like, today or tomorrow. So, yeah. This was the full devlog, un well, somewhat unedited, I did put them all together, of these things. It was when I decided, hey, I'm going to record this of an update. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. It's... If you want to, or if you don't want to, you can subscribe or not, but I don't really care. But, yeah, I will see you next time. I probably won't do another video like this. I might, but, yeah, bye!